Hey, 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 have you ever wondered about a, what type of charger you got? How do you read the lights? How does it work? Because there are so many lights, man. There are different codes. People plug them in like, what the hell does this mean? All right, well, I'm going to show you this here, man. We got the Quick Q. One of the best chargers they make, in my opinion. Um, you can change the algorithm on them for different types of batteries. Uh, or... And one good thing about it is, it's a battery maintainer all in one. So if you have this style charger, all you do is leave it plugged into your golf cart. Now there's a fine line now, cause you leave it plugged into your golf cart, but it don't come back on until it gets so low in voltage. So if you're gone for two weeks or three weeks and your golf cart batteries are dead, but it isn't low enough voltage where it kicks the charger on and you go drive it, you're gonna think your car is just dead. Well, it is going to be because the charger hasn't come back on. So always, even though if you have this style charger, always when you come in the night before and you go take it out tomorrow, reset the charger. All right. Now I'm going to show you how to read this charger here now. All right. Because the charger is kind of misleading, man, if you think about it. You would think that it's dead. It goes here and shuts off here. No, it don't. What it does is it slowly goes up. One, two, three, four, five. It slowly goes up. Then when it gets about half charge, it holds this number here, all right? And then when it gets full charge, it comes back down. And then you'll see this light here light up at 80% charge. Then it'll light up another light at the same spot, the battery light here at 100% charge. What the wavy line means is that you're plugged into the AC power, meaning you have, you have AC bolts, all right? And you can see, I have it plugged in. We have AC voltage. But you can see it blinking a fault code. Two, three, four, five, six. That's six red lights. What that means, you have no battery voltage because I don't have it plugged in. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna unplug it from the, from, from the cord. And then I'm gonna let the battery charger just cut you gotta let it bleed down so it's just gonna cut itself off eventually the red light will go out <clears throat> now on some of these models you can change the algorithm some you can't the way it works normally if your charger has a plug on it you can't change the algorithm it is set from the factory with this style algorithm for your battery if you have one and it's actually an onboard charger and you can, and it has a plug like this with a red wire and it don't have a plug, it has wires on it. Then this one here, you can reset your algorithm. You plug it into the uh, wall, it flashes the light, you touch it to the main positive for three seconds, let go. Every three seconds, the algorithm changes. You can type in, go on the internet, type in the model number. And then um, go online, type in the model. Like you want to type in model 9134800E5, quick, huge algorithm. All right. Now, what you want to do when you plug it in to the AC power. So when you now plug it into the wall. Plug it in there, if I can get it plugged in. Look at your charger. Now you can see it blinking a three code, which is threes right here. This is three. One, one, two, three. One, two, three. That means that the algorithm is three. All right? And three is Trojan wet cell flooded batteries. All right? Now, if you're flashing a number here, then it's whatever number this is. If this ain't flashing, when this flashes the code, that means it's a, it's a double digit algorithm but this here you just seen it let me show you again now i'm making this one of my members my member asked me about it so i, I thought i had one but i couldn't find it so i'm sure everybody so if you want to if you want to become a member man request your own special video go to my page click on the members and become a member and i'll make you a video so once it dies down i'll plug it back in All right, it died down, plugging it back in. And you can see it'll go up. 
I'm gonna reset it, and then this is gonna blink three, that's gonna blink three. So this is a three algorithm, all right? Now when I plug it into the car, you see the charger. Let it come on. Let me get it come on. Get it come on. Well, right now it's an algorithm stage, so I'm gonna unplug it from the wall. And plug it back in. Alright, see the charger starts there. So right now all I'm doing is reading the card. You see how much voltage the car needs, and then you see it go up. So that means it's over half charge. It's going to top off here, and as it gets about 80%, that light will come on, the battery light, start blinking, and then this here will start to drop. All right, and then whenever this here goes off, and this is light up by itself, it's 100%. If you see it flashing a red fault code, and you have that plugged in, and you have that plugged in, then you got a problem with the charger. If it ain't a six code, meaning that you have a bad DC cord or a bad DC battery voltage, then you're probably going to need a new charger. But all right, man, stay tuned, man. I'll post more. Like I said, become a member, man. Request your special video. Get your golf cart fixed. Or give me a call, man. Go to my home page. Click on that, man. Always remember one thing about this channel. Hey, hey, hey.